This is Jason back here behind the mic having a pretty good time talk, talking all kinds of crazy stuff. Sitting beside me with the beautiful Charlie. Yep. <laughs> now you really got a lot to say. Okay. Well, it sounds like we may. company being a cross dresser nowadays. Love you brother. For XBW in Indianapolis because that's where he's at right now. <coughs> but what, what where's everybody else at? I mean why did you come out by yourself? I mean you could come out of TNT we can a little Johnny Cash that's pretty cool. But where's everybody else? I have no clue. And wow, I'm really out of breath. October was forever ago. Do you know where everybody else is at? Daddy, God Why damn it! <laughs> I gotta stop too much money. Did somebody really see me go to put the microphone to my mouth and hit somebody's goddamn music again? <laughs> oh, jeez, Helen, come on. I gotta start getting some down and out by tantric playing the next time we all come out here. I mean, this is just ridiculous. That's right, baby. What is it, that? Well, is it that? I think that is. There's no way, though. That, that, that is Blackwell's new music. You're his wife, is in Indianapolis, isn't he? He was last time I talked to him. Okay, somebody's screwing around on the side. Yeah, that's cool. That's okay, fine. HPW First Blood 2014. The music continues, though. Seriously? Uh, all right, production all right. truck, production people, whoever's back there. 
Oh, looky here. We do have a black well. John Steele looks like he's not too sure about this one. You didn't lie to me in a text today. You said you're in Indianapolis. And you're posting all over Facebook saying I'm not going to be there, yada, yada, yada. I went along saying we're going to miss you. You're coming back old school black belt with the trench coat. That's cool. I like it. He probably is. That's some bitch can be in two places at once. Nobody else's business. Damn, it feels good to be back. Maybe. 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 The new tradition, 2014 style, baby. That's the way we work now. Without further ado, I'm going to let my bigger brother, Big Daddy Paul Steele, for the first time in his company's rich history, work the mic. Oh, yeah. You know what? I sat at home this entire fall and this entire winter. When I left here, I wasn't too happy with anything that was going on around here except for the fact that we got a ring and some nice backdrops. But you know, being that I am who I am, it is my job to make changes. It is my job to make sure that the new and that the better comes through each and every year. That's right, brother. Preach on, brother. Preach every on. Year. So, a couple of things I need to do. First of all, you're right at what you said earlier. Not everybody's out here. Where the hell is Mustafa Akkad? I was calling out the man from the stage. I didn't realize he was part of TNT. <coughs> look at the look on. Of John Steele's face. Look at the Where's look Mustafa Akkad? Or the kamikaze kid. Which either one wants to come out, I don't care. Looks like the stuff of coming out. Yeah, yeah, the man from the sand. Really? 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 Blackwell giving the dead stare he usually does. <laughs> you all fell for it. <laughs> well, don't none of them look happy. They all called him out and he don't look happy at all about it. <laughs> you know what, brother? I sense a little bit of tension here. Not to sound like Hulk Hogan, although I just did. I sense a little bit of tension here. <laughs> you know, I'm going to tell you something. My... My decisions have not always been popular decisions. But you know, I do what's best for this company. I do what's best for the new tradition, and I do what's best for everybody back there in the back when I do it, even though it's not popular at the time. How doing, brother? <laughs> it seems to me, before you two get any further in this, it seems to me <laughs> that we got a problem here to work out. Not only that, we got some unfinished business. Y'all took it upon yourselves last season to jump through Kalian, True. which is probably not the wisest choice that you can make, but you did it. So now to better you as wrestlers and better you as the new tradition and to make you better people, I'm going to give you the opportunity to close that business that y'all started. <laughs> so tonight what I would like to have is I would like to have Sean Steele and Mustafa Akkad to face in this ring and close that business, the Lord of Pain, Deucalion, and Lustkill. <laughs> now there's a tag match. We always oh, wanted to see the monster Him and his dad and son? Whoa, 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 whoa. What? 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 I, I was hoping it was a dream and it was a lie, you know, that well, my, my thought process is going through. Apparently, it's not. What do you mean? You know, you come out here with, with your HPW World Heavyweight Championship belt. Yes. As the HPW champion. Yes. And my older brother here just said that tonight, it is you and I versus Deucalion and Luskill. The beasts of HPW. Now, you know, ever since you came away with the HPW championship, which I laid down for your ass for, 
Yeah. Be cocky about that, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Now, just, I mean, just hold on. No, 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 you hold on. I held on all last year. I'm Big Daddy. Steve. I don't we care don't who you are. Do. You just listen up right now. I'm tired of all of this. Let me I tell you exactly. something. Are you proud of this? Are you proud that they took up somebody like you and made you into something? Mustafa! If you have a problem with him being champion, <laughs> I've got a solution. You just told your horses. If you win that match tonight, brother, you get a shot at that title. What? You know what? What? I thought about this long and hard. Real long and hard. I can tell you this right now. You understand that? What? In that tag match tonight, you show up with a game face. Show up ready for this match. This isn't just anybody. This is Deucalion and Lust Kill. You come with your game face, or I'll knock the damn face off your neck. You understand me? I think this means the world to me. And as for the rest of you, I now see what the whole plan's all about. I now see what it is. Anyone who's funny about it, you can all say, this is yeah, TNT right business. Good. What's funny about that now? I created TNT. So y'all <laughs> can take this shirt. You can rip it off your torso. You can walk that son of a bitch up and stick it up your ass. Because I am through with TNT. You understand that? Oh, I got my reasons. <laughs> really? Yeah, really. Seriously. Come on, Tom, think about this. Sean, what are you doing? Come on. Let him go. Let him go. Shut up. We don't need him. You got me. You know what? You ain't nothing. Here's the thing. Whether retard there is a TNT or not, the bottom line is this. I can think about it whether you're right or whether you're wrong. Here's the thing. Earlier today I thought about this. And right now, I know what TNT is going to try. I know what you guys are going to try to do. You're going to try to do is take care of business TNT style. You and I, we'll take care of family business outside of the square circle. But you know what? You all can send whoever you want. It doesn't matter because right now I'm, I got that feeling. I got that clicky feeling. Uh, and I invited a friend of mine that I think you all know real well to join the party just in case you all decide. Oh, you didn't know? I believe that is wildfire devil. We have seen him May I reintroduce to HPW and to Get the new tradition. Oh, keep on running your mouth a call. Keep on running it. This is gonna be Blackwell's face. Last time we Mr. saw Mr. Wildfire himself, Cody Douglas! Uh oh, Douglas. Douglas looks like he wants to beat uh, Mr. Blackwell. Mr. Blackwell looks like he'd be more than willing to give it so to TNT, him. I just got two words for you. And now it's not sucking. Bring it. I beat your sorry ass, Sean, three times. I can live it out. You're a low class dumb job of bitch. Shut up. Did you know about this? A tag team match. No. You know something? I stop TNT. You know something? I didn't know about this, but I'm not surprised. Did I not spend an entire year saying that that man's head was not in the game? Number one, I didn't authorize this putting together of TNT. Number two, I don't know what the hell everybody's problem here is. So you know what? I'm just going to move on with business. First of all. You know what? You guys go in the back. I'm going to talk to you about that stuff in a little bit. Seriously. This is not the way to start off a year. This is not what Big Daddy Steel came here to do. Douglas Black is furious. A cod, I ain't sure what's going on with him. He's all kinds of cocky, which is unusual for a cod. He used to be a pretty serious guy. Chris Cage is still pretty much an unknown quantity. You know what? If every single one of these so-called top-tier guys walks out of here tonight, HPW in and of itself is still strong, and we're still going to put on a hell of a show. We have this American title. And you know what? I'm going to put that American title 
into a triple threat match. And second of all, Chris Cage, you know, you're the new guy and you say you're wanting to be in TNT and apparently you are. Well, you know, we've got a tradition and a history. And that is anybody that steps in the ring and claims to be TNT has to earn those colors. So, Chris Cage, tonight you will be earning those colors against the mystery opponent. And don't get me wrong, this is not a negative thing towards you. This is you becoming <coughs> and leading your destiny. And last but not least, before his mystery opponent comes out, let me say that this belt right here, the title that started it all, the HTR title, 